What's happening everyone? Welcome back into the Drum Central channel. I am, as always, Dave Major. And here we've got a really cool seven beat Tony Royster fill. So, this one particularly, get that PDF that's below, print it out, let's follow along, let's get straight to it. So, where to start? The fill starts on the four of the first bar. So it kind of starts, if we're playing a halftime beat, which this song is, we're going one, two, three, four E and R on the kick. We then continue all the way through the next bar, all the way halfway through the next bar, landing with a really strong snare drum back on the back beat of three. So this is like longer than any fill ever invented and any of your drum teachers have told you to play, but it's really cool. So let's learn it anyway. The first part of it is a really common fusion-y kind of sticking or gospel sticking, right, left, left kick. That starts on four in the first bar and that's four hi-hat, two ghosted snare drums, kick drum. Four E and A. We play the same thing again. Right hand on the floor tom this time, two lefts, kick drum, and that's now one E and out of the next bar. So let's put those two together. That on its own is a really cool fill if you play it four, five, six, a thousand times and orchestrate it differently. We've then got, we've now landed on beat two. We've got another kick drum. So we're actually going one E and a uh, two on the bass drum. Two, left on the hi-hat, kind of with an accent. Then we're going over our stacker and we're going to play right and then come straight down to the floor tom on the right. So we're kind of playing kick, left, right, right. And this is doing what's commonly called a sweep. We start high, come down to a lower drum. We can sweep from the toms. We can actually sweep across as well. So that part, two E and of the second bar, sounds like this. So from this sweep stacker thing, we're gonna play two lefts on the three E, ghosted. Right, left, and out of three, snare drum. Then we're gonna go right on the four, E, and, and then end with a kick drum. That one bar on its own is a pretty kick-ass fill, but it doesn't end there. We then, from that kick drum, hit a nice strong flam on the one of the first bar, or the third bar now followed by a kick drum, and then two hi-hats on and ah. Uh. So that is. <laughs> on beat two of the third bar, we've got kick, kick, two E. Then we've got and with a left, Ah, a hi-hat that is lifted up, and then a strong snare drum, and that's us. So this third bar sounds like this, starting on that flam. So now let's try that all together, no metronome yet, and let's see how we get on. Now let's try that at a metronome marking of 85, let's see how we get on. Ooh, that one 
take some work. Now let's try it at 1.15. See how we get on. Before we do that, I cannot stress the importance of just going up in tiny little increments. If it's one beat a minute, that's, that's cool. It doesn't have to be, oh, we're gonna jump 20 beats a minute. It's really important that it's clean, not fast. Let's try it at 1.15. And finally, at absolutely ridiculous Tony Royster speed of 145. So, I really hope you dug that. I had great fun learning it. If you like this lesson or any of our previous ones, please do hit subscribe, follow through to the Drum Central website, which is drumcentral.co.uk, and I'll catch you guys next time.